There you are, Ezio. Why so serious? It's my birthday. Davvero? Cento di questi giorni. That's wonderful. Is it? It's been over ten years since I watched my father and brothers die. Ten years hunting the men responsible. So close to the end now, but... No closer to understanding what any of it was for. You may not see it, Ezio, but it's better here now because of the things you've done. Basta. Look here. I have a birthday present for you. It's L'Arsenale's shipping manifest. From the day the boat left. The boat to Cyprus? You're serious. And guess when it's scheduled to return? Tomorrow. Ezio. Leonardo! When did you get back? Just now. I need to talk to you. Right away. <laughs> Go on. Have fun, boys. It's better be good. Oh, it is. It is. Walk with me. Stay close. These last two codex pages. I was studying the copies. I don't know why I never saw it before. But when put together, I realize the markings on the back clarify into words. Here. The Prophet will appear when the second piece is brought to the floating city. The prophet? Only the Prophet may open it. Two pieces of Eden. What are you saying? Ezio, what is this? We've known each other a long time, Leonardo. If I can't trust you, there is nobody. My uncle Mario spoke of it long ago. A prophecy hidden in the Codex. Leading to an ancient vault that holds something very powerful. Grandioso. But if you took these pages from the Barbarigo, then maybe they know about this vault too. That's not good. Wait. What if that's why they sent the ship to Cyprus? To find this piece of Eden and bring it back to Venezia? When the second piece is brought to the floating city, the Prophet will appear. Only the Prophet can open the vault. My God! When my uncle told me about the Codex, I was too young, too brash to imagine he was anything but an old man's fantasy. But now I see. The killing of Mochenigo. Even the Medici. My father and brothers. It was all part of his plan. To find the vault. The Spaniard. Rodrigo Borgia. The boat from Cyprus arrives tomorrow. I plan to be there to meet it. Good luck, my friend. It's a tale of death by...